Are you overwhelmed by managing submissions through emails and spreadsheets? Are you seeking a more efficient way to collect and review applications? Well, if you are ready to streamline your submission process, I'll introduce you this powerful tool. Meet Submittable, a robust submission management platform designed to simplify your entire process from collecting applications to final decisions. Whether you're handling grants, scholarships, contests, or job applications, Submittable centralizes and streamlines your workflow. With Submittable, you can effortlessly build custom forms, collaborate with your team, and manage submissions all in one place. Its intuitive interface and powerful features make it adaptable to various organizational needs, enhancing productivity and transparency. From automated workflows to real-time tracking and reporting, Submittable empowers you to make informed decisions swiftly. In this tutorial, we'll explore how Submittable can transform your submission process. We'll cover setting up your account, creating forms, managing submissions, and utilizing reporting tools. Plus, we'll highlight resources to help you get started and make the most of the platform. First things first, head over to their website, which is submittable.com. Now, from in there, you can see the pricing, their kind of solutions, products that they offer, and likes. You can also talk to sales. If you already talked to sales and you already have an account, you can click on the design in option right here. Choose the submittable option for the software that you want to sign into. Now, from in there, it should be able to redirect you to the submissions or the actual sign in page of submittable. Since I already have an account, it redirects me to the actual dashboard. So onto the dashboard, you can see in here my submissions, my drafts, as well as external sub submissions. So you can see in here every submissions that you have made or applied to on a job order, as well as grants and scholarship. Now in here, you can also click on the this Discover option in order to discover the grants or scholarship or job opportunities that you can actually go over and then apply with. We have in here job opportunities with no deadlines. We also have opportunities that has set deadlines and you can see in here the date as well as the cost to actually apply to that. Now onto these opportunities, you can head over and then just filter them according to following. No fees, deadlines, no deadlines as well as selecting the dates for those deadlines. So this is great if you're actually looking for no fees. You can see in them right there. So all of the opportunities or forms created are actually right here. So for example, let's click on the Discourse Anthology. You can see in here this. You can see the tags for that, the description, and you can see the actual description. Like for example, this will be a book that features poetry. And you can upload up to 10 pieces. For this case, you can click on the submit option in order to submit an actual answer to their form. So I have signed up for the submittable for the actual customer. So in here, it will show me the form instead of creating it. So you can upload in here file, input right here your bio, some details about you supporting them as well as saving them as draft and submitting your actual portfolio or your answer to this case. So you can also follow this particular magazine as well as a poster for this one as well. Now let's head back right there. Now from in here, you can also click on the saved option in the upper corner and you can see in here all of the opportunities that you have saved. So you can actually go over and then try to get back to them later on. You can also click on the manage labels and then from in there, it will direct you to your using user settings. So you can input right here the settings for your profile picture, credit cards, personal labels, 
as well as personalization, changing your password as far as your profile info. Now, you can also find as well right here your following. So in here, you can see in here any organizations that you follow. So if you're an organization and you want to create a form, then the best thing that you can do is to talk to sales and to actually create a form through there. So through the submittable website, you can head over and see here some resources as well. So as you have noticed under the submittable, they have a drag and drop form builder. So you can just drag the title as well as the choices and also the questions that you want to add onto your actual form. You can also establish real-time collaboration through them through this way because this can power cross-team work with real-time collaboration tools, in-app communication, and organization portal that allows team members to coordinate their efforts. So they can apply as an individual as well as applying on behalf of an organization. Now, Submittable also have financial tracking tools. So you can stay on top of the budget with real-time tracking that reflects drawdowns and categorizes disimbursement. So we have in here the award. So for example, we are posting a grant and you can see in here this. We have the grant budget as well as a project budget. You can see in here a chart of how much is remaining from the actual amount from the grant itself. You can see in here a visualization if it's actually getting down from the actual needed value. Now, the great thing about Submittable is they have a dynamic reporting that captures the full impact of advanced reporting and integrated analytics across all programs. You can see in here the analytics, the reviews, applications, as well as the awards. So for the analytics, you can see there all of the applications or submissions under review, those that are disqualified, awarded, declined, selected, and awarded in here for that particular category as well. You can see a quick glance of all of the details that you need for that. Now, their grant is also quick to launch. You can just click on the this create new program and open that program according to your liking. It's very easy to use and you can see in here some testimonies from people that have actually used Submittable. Now, you can also take the administrative burden of grantees because they can have an easy-to-navigate software that cuts down on workload and gives every applicant clear next steps to their actual needs. So, as you have noticed, Submittable is a comprehensive solution for managing submissions. So, if you're ready to transform your submission process, you can visit their website to start your free trial or schedule a demo to see how Submittable can meet your specific needs. If you found this tutorial helpful, please like, subscribe, and share it with others in your network. If you have any questions or experiences with Submittable, we'd like to hear about them. Thank you so much for watching.